time for the Ryan Report on Atlanta's big station, V103. Ah, that's where I'll be this time. That's right. Log on to v-103.com and find out what it is. And let's start out with Chelsea Handler. Okay. On uh, Pierce Morgan last night. Yeah. She is getting it started. Yeah, man, she really is. Saying why Ashton and, and Demi really split. Mm-hmm. Claiming that they had a, an open relationship and they like to swing, swing, swing. I think it's pretty, pretty obvious to everybody. You know, I, again, I don't know them personally very well, I, but um, I think it's pretty obvious that she's probably, um, they've probably had a lot of um, open marriage type situations, which always lead to. Do you think so? Well, yeah, I think they par- probably had a lot of good times with some other women, and then, really? yeah, of How course. Do you know this? Well, come on, I mean, read between the lines. What lines? The lines of cocaine on the table. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't know what kind of drugs they've ever participated in, but uh, clearly they probably had a lot of threesomes that led to twosomes without Demi, and that leads to a divorce. Wow. He did like a Scooby Doo noise. <laughs> <laughs> You know, the thing is, is that you know what she really wants to say, because Chelsea Handler's friends with a lot of those A-list people. Now, I mean, she's great friends with Jennifer Aniston, and, you know, that's why she goes off on Angelina Jolie Why get married if you want to do that? Why not just swing? Why get married and then decide to swing? Just swing. Well, maybe they didn't originally go into the marriage thinking they wanted to swing. Does that never happen? They get into it, they're like, yo, this monogamy thing ain't really working. No, it's probably like, hey, lady, you old. <laughs> Dem- Demi looks good for her age. She's 50 years old, but dang it, she can... She you know what 50 gray. years old means? What? Gray down there. Oh, my God. Okay? Grecian formula down there. Oh, my gosh. Did you That's just say not gr- sexy. Grecian formula. Hey, everybody he was messing with was like 20 years I'm old. I'm saying, so man. Yeah. Come on, man. Any man to tell you. Oh. Somebody want that? Don't marry the cougar? Man, no. You want that gray down there? All right. You know what I'm saying? Okay. The real meaning of AAR. <laughs> I'm on one. All right, let's move on. Uh, speaking of sex, there is no sex tape for Chris Brown. Media Takeout says they've seen it. But a rep for CB says, nope, not possible. They're saying, uh, what's that, Drea, Drea Michelle? Yeah, Drea Michelle. From Basketball Wives. That's uh-huh. who he's in the tape with. Yeah. But a rep for Brown says, absolutely not true. I mean, you had to think something was going on. The the seller only wanted fifty thousand dollars for Chris Brown sex tape. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, if that one chick from the Playboy show, what is it, the Kendra? Yeah, if she can get a mill, then Chris Brown. You know, the possibilities are endless. You know what? What? I've seen the tape. And? You know who it is in the blonde hair? Who? It's Cisco from Drew Hill. <laughs> It's the first time he started anything in a long time, so good for him. And yeah, you know what the woman has on? What? Thong, 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 thong. Yeah, okay, I walked right into that. You no, know, people one. say like they act like they hated that song. Oh, everybody loves that, that song. That song was number one, so stop acting like right. we're, gonna, we're gonna put it in the uh, energy shot one Let's day. Let's do it. Songs that you claim to hate but you really right. love. Yeah, yeah. Put that in there. I like that. Yeah. Girl, shake that laugh it, tap it. That laugh it, tap it. Ooh, I hate that. No, you didn't. You was didn't. laughing. You were, sure was. You, you wanted to be Fabo. Shut sure, up. Sure was. All right. John Singleton is not going to direct the uh, Tupac biopic. Okay. He can't get along with anybody. But he's the second director to drop out following the struggle to find an actor to actually play Tupac. That's the hard part. Yeah. Of course, now he's going to try to do the NWA biopic. I am in line to be the new director of the Tupac movie. And, of course, everybody knows who I want to play Tupac. Who is that? Aretha Franklin. I'm just, I'm not even going to play with you or respond with you today. You're crazy. Speaking of which, though. Riri's back. Okay. Riri's back. That's all that they are yelling at. You know what? Riri's back. If Halle Berry can play Aretha Franklin. Than anybody can. Speaking of biopics, have you heard who they are saying is going to play the new Steve Jobs? Yao Ming. No. Um, seriously, guess. Think about it. Obviously, he's got to be Caucasian. Oh. He's well, I had another not. guess. Okay. Because you said gray-haired guy. Well, yeah. He's. Th- think about someone who is a sexy, you know, older, gray-haired guy in Hollywood. Sean Connery? 
Ryan, Sean Connery is 90. No, he's got thick oh, Okay, I'm sorry. Sexiest get, okay. man alive, younger, gray hair. Younger, yes, younger. Sir. Gray hair, sexy. Morgan Freeman. Morgan Freeman? To play Steve Jobs. He played God. Okay, you know what, Ryan? It's if you hey, wait, if you can play God, you can play Steve Jobs. It's George Clooney. And a lot Clooney. of people thought that G- Steve Jobs was God. What? It's George Clooney, Ryan. Gray hair. He's sexy Hollywood. Good looking guy. Really? Jo- you don't see that? If you would have to ask me, I'd say, mm, Arthur Blank. All right, just, I'm going to go ahead and hit the button now. I'm just gonna this thing, so. It's Friday, suckers, and that's the Ryan Report. And if you don't know, now you know, you know, you know. The Ryan Report. The Ryan Report.